<laughs> hello, 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 and welcome to a long time coming. My name is Haley McLean. This is Min Max, and this is the first video we're able to put on the Min Max channel of Leo and I's Red Dead Redemption roleplay streams. We've been doing this for three weeks straight now, every Monday night, and we're freaking loving it. So the first two episodes you can find over on Leo's channel, leovader.com. Uh, it, under his playlist, there's under his playlist on his YouTube channel. There, I've tried to record them on my side, and when I the last time I tried recording last week, um, my audio capture didn't capture any in game voice chat, so I just sound like a crazy person talking to myself. But we've already played around with it, we've already made sure it works, so now I can c capture audio. And for those of you who don't know how <laughs> role play works, Leo and I have joined this very Strict sir, it's not too strict, but it's a decently strict server. And everyone who's in here, if they're not an NPC, is a player and they have to role play actually living in this world. So, no talking about real world things, no talking about anything off server. So, Leo and I don't talk to each other on Discord or anything when we play this. We just talk via chat in character. So, my character's name is Sierra Sage. This is my character here on our, and my horse, Winona. And I'm actually going to just go try to find Leo, whose character is P. Long Vong. And a little backstory, a little, a quick season recap of where we've got so far. Uh, oh, there, that looks, they are robbing those people. They are robbing those people. I'm running away. People will, uh, they are robbing those people. Go this way. Oi, oi, oi. <laughs> so, season, season one recap. Uh, Leo and I, Leo got kidnapped-ish by an outlaw, but then they ended up being nice, an outlaw camp, they ended up being nice to us. We put on a play to thank them. We ended up getting the theater bug, as Leo puts it, and we decided, why don't, and we both decided, let's travel to, to St. Denis and become traveling, traveling theater thespians. So now we're traveling town to town, and we've done several shows, and people tip us exorbitant amounts of money. I have $80 because random people give me money at the end of our shows. <laughs> and Leo got $200 from a sheriff guy once in one go. It was insane. Like, I worked construction for, a, like, an hour. Is that Pilon? That's not Pilon. And I only made, like, $16. So $200 is, like, an insane amount of money in this world's game. So as soon as I see, see Pilon, I'm going to have to be in character. We got a couple plans for today. We're going to do a couple shows. I think... Once I find Pilon, I'm just gonna be in character, no more talking to the audience, because then I'll just turn my mic on. This is where we did our show last time. We did a lovely show called Stockholm on the Range, where a captive woman falls in love with her captor. Uh, we need to go to the bank, because we have a shit ton of money. Oh no. Something's going on over there. Oh no, I think I'm gonna go this way. <gasps> what if that's Pilon over there? <laughs> There's Pilon! <laughs> it's running across the street! <laughs> Let me turn on my, uh. So it's no longer push to talk. I can just talk. So I always forget to push to talk. Howdy, Pilon. Howdy. I may, I'm making some new friends over here. Oh, what are you up to over here? I trust these men. Seems like it. What are y'all up to? I like your alligator hat. Whoopsie, Winona. You're being pretty sassy. Y'all are, are very quiet fellers. I was wondering if my ears weren't working, they're being so quiet. <laughs> yeah, I think your ears are working out. Are my, I think mine are working out. I can hear your voice. Yeah, oh, you wow. You sound great. <laughs> you sound great too, Pilo. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, some knives are coming out. I might take a little step this direction. <laughs> Hello? Excuse me? I was so bloody not. 
One more time, sir. Jeff Jefferson. Oh, Lord. That there's Jeff Jefferson? Jeff Jefferson. Howdy, Jeff. Howdy, Howdy Jeff. I like your purple shirt. Where is that Jeff? Oh, I think Jeff might be running away. Sierra, why don't we step to the side right quick? <laughs> so good, p -Law. Winona! Get out of the building, Winona! But Get out of there, Winona! Get out of the building, girl! Girl, get down here! Get out of here! She always, she's always been doing this stuff. Oh, sorry! <laughs> sorry about that, p I, it happens, it happens. I see like those fellers! <laughs> I see those fellers getting all riled up. It's getting me wanted to do some fighting, too! I Kind of, I'm getting a little scared, no doubt. It seems we're locked in combat at the moment. Go ahead, what? Take those Why are we doing this? I wonder. Blocked. <laughs> well, aren't you just a little firecracker today, P. Long? Come here, you little rascal. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> you can throw a fist in. You're allowed to hit women back these times. There we go. Finally. Get your hat. Clean off. Well, I don't even know where it went. It flew into the dirt. <laughs> Clean out of this. Let's ground. get your hat out of there. That thing's on there tight. There we go. There it goes. <laughs> there it goes. How do I stop one to fight you? Maybe if I run this way. Oh, there we go. All right. Things well, let's things hope our hats come back at some point. <laughs> I am covered in bruises. That was a hoot. My face <laughs> is bloody <laughs> beaten. You know what I'm thinking? If you want to give me a ride to Strawberry, head there together while I compose a letter to that gang we almost... <laughs> Alright, uh, unnecessary. Sorry, Pilon. I was coming out of a, a thought, and I, when I flexed my left click muscle, it thought I meant punch. That's understandable. <laughs> Excuse my behavior. Love to give you a ride. Thank well, no. you kindly. I was thinking about, you know, this uh, this gang we forsook. Yes, sir. Winona's spicy it's today. Like thinking it might be safer to forget about them and never look back, but I would like to extend an olive branch for their kindness and let them know where they can find us. Let them, let them know there's no hard feeling. Do you think that'll ever come back and bite us and they, you know, end up wanting some money paid back for them tools we got for free <laughs> never paid them back for? That's about as south as I could see it going, but you know, we have made money at this point to pay them back. I would love to squash that, squash that beef, so to speak. Squash I that beef. Get on your horse. Uh, let me see here. How about now? No, ma'am. Hmm. I think it's because Winona, Winona's quite upset. Come here, Winona, calm down. Stop freaking out, you. Jesus, Winona! That is your Uncle P. Long. You do not do that. Easy, girl. <laughs> Winona! Sorry about that, P. Long. She's awful spicy today. I don't really know what's going on. Get out of here, girl. I might really be down for the count here. <laughs> I believe I was knocked out. Oh dear, p -Long. we've never had to deal with this kind of thing so far in our adventures. <laughs> there oh, you thank go, the Lord. I, it truly, I truly lost consciousness. It's a miracle that I'm okay at the moment. God, p I was going to say, I don't know the proper procedures and such for getting you your medical care. <laughs> that could have been let's, a fiasco. Let's never find out. All right, I, I refreshed Winona's mind. Let's see if she's calmed down a bit since I sent her on a timeout for, for a minute. Hello, sir. Strong quiet hat. A lot of them around Blackwater, it seems. Yeah. How are you storing your gun on your horse's shoulder with nothing there? That's a little off. Winona! Get your ass over here, girl! I'm wondering now maybe if someone has taken her over on this side. Oh, there you are. 
Here we go, Pilon. She just got stuck on a piece of brick or something. How about now? She seems more calm. Nothing, nothing doing. What the heck is going on with you? You can't ride horses no more? You shy? You weak? <laughs> How do you explain this, Pilon, is what I'm putting, is what I'm asking. <laughs> I've been putting on a brave face up until now, but the truth is I am deathly afraid of heights. You know, we're only about three more feet up off the ground. Don't even say the amount of feet. That will make it even scarier. That's a trigger. I apologize. Well, why don't you sit in the saddle first and see if that makes a difference? Calm down there, girl. Yeah, take her for a little walk. Let her get used to your scent. She's just uncomfortable with you. That's all. <laughs> Jesus. My apologies. <laughs> we are on something today. I tell you what, I think it's all this ruckus around here. <laughs> Perhaps our animosity towards each other is a factor in me not be able to get on this horse. That's all right. I'll call. Interesting. Mine. Winona is is feeling the energy that we're putting out. What's your horse's name? I don't think I ever learned that. Oh dear. Doctor? Anyone? Sorry? Anyone a doctor? Oh no, not sorry. You you're a doctor. No, no, he just—he's just, just dressed fancy. Uh, no worries, thank you. Hear that, people? They thought you were a doctor. <laughs> wow. Well, perhaps I'm uh, could be playing a doctor role soon. <laughs> perhaps we'll do a little Grey's Anatomy type thing. I just came up with that word, that name. I like that Grey's Anatomy. We That's can... interesting. Like a cow grazing in the field. <laughs> Grazing anatomy, perfect. So we going to strawberry? Yeah, follow my lead. All I right, think I'll... we should stop on the way, and I'll compose that letter. Though I do want to let them know yes, that please. we'll be putting on Romeo and Juliet and Strawberry. Oh uh, yes, that's where we left off. Was preparing for our big show. Where's my hat? I think I left Can it. You back speak there. up a little bit while we're riding. Oh yeah. How's this? Better. That's good. What's your horse's name? I do forget. <laughs> well, that's not very kind to not even know your own animal's name. Pilon Strawberries this way. You're right. You're right. <laughs> that's like just like every man in the old west never stops for directions. That's a man throughout all of history, huh? <laughs> yeah, never stop it. Just go, go, go. I think those men were gonna rob me earlier that we saw in town. Do you feel like you have adequate uh, self-defense options? No, I mean I have my little, I have a little tiny gun that I got for about thirteen dollars. And I got my knife, and I got my rope. That's about and and a varmint rifle. <laughs> That's about it. Okay. Howdy. A little rude. To, that was a little to rude. Not say howdy. Yeah, you gotta say howdy if you say howdy. Do you want to write your letter now? Yeah. I'm fixing to. They'll appreciate that kindness in, in turn. Let me, All right, let me help me compose this. Yeah, what do we reckon we call them? Dearest outlaws? You think they'll be offended? I don't think so. I think they're pretty proud outlaws from my experience with them. That's true. They were saying all this stuff like, we like to kill and stuff. They were, they were damn near getting off on it. <laughs> I think uh, they were. Subject. Our absence. <laughs> Sounds like we're putting in a letter to our job. <laughs> in a way, we are. <laughs> in a way. Actually, that is true, Philon. All right. Chime in whenever you like. Dearest Cody, I hope this letter finds you well. We are still so appreciative of all the help you have given us as Greenhorns. 
in this new area. Therefore, comma, we would like to invite you to our newest and biggest show yet. Oh, well, you know, I think I, I'm going to take it back a sentence here, and I do think we need to establish that we've been bitten by the acting bug. I don't <laughs> think that's we did do something our, he's yet aware of. We did do our show for them, that very first show that, that bit us right on the rump with that acting bug. It's true, they got his teeth in our rumps real good. <laughs> yeah, that acting bug, all right. Well, if you... I, I hope, I'm, I'm going to say this. Okay. You may remember our performance we put on as a way of thanking y'all. <laughs> y'all. For y'alls. Shut up. All of course. Well, we got bitten by the acting bug. Something Fierce. terminal. Some <laughs> terminal. That's even worse. Love it. Can't go back to that. Oh, there we go. Something terminal. I'm exclamation point for excitement. Yeah. Okay. Hopefully they can read. Oh, hopefully. <laughs> Fingers crossed. We've been traveling this. Fair land putting on our shows of fur in the. Oh, God. Oh, right. Sorry, Pilon. I'm trying to shoot a. <laughs> I was trying to shoot a farm with my farm rifle. <laughs> Did that take you out of the whole writing thing? No. I'm still focused. I'm okay, still good, good, focused. good. I okay. really hope that did just delete all the work you just did. Well, I saw a muskrat or something, but it ran away. I was trying to get us some supper. I'm sure my yelp of agony <laughs> scared it. We'd like to invite you to our upcoming performance. What'd you call it? Our biggest and bravest yet? <laughs> our biggest and best show yet. Biggest and bra we'll be pretty brave jumping off that roof there. That will be brave. We may earnestly get hurt. We might have to ask we'll is there a doctor in the audience? A very special rendition of Romeo and Juliet in Strawberry in what? In uh. 30 minutes? Yeah, let's say 30 minutes. Give, us, give them some time to ride over from the next town over. That's fair. That's fair. Hopefully they are uh, awake. Hopefully they are conscious in this land, so to speak. We'd love to see you there and make right our <laughs> transgressions owences for the farming gear. Y'all kindly gifted our way. Yeah, we've been getting a lot of free stuff. You got that rope from Rose's Dance Academy? Still? I lost that. I don't know where that went. What? It might just be in your flex and eye muscle inventory. <laughs> I didn't see it in there. I didn't see it in there. Oh, dear. Uh, how do I end this thing? Thanks, partners. Thanks, partners. See you real soon at Strawberry. So they feel obligated to come like we're expecting it. That is, in my understanding, is a big part of putting on a little independent show like this. Is you find friends, acquaintances, and Guilt you... trip. Guilt trip. Precisely you the word Absolutely guilt for. trip. Wish my friends cared about my art. So to speak. <laughs> Would love to have a bit more support from my quote-unquote loved ones. Let me just throw in a PS. It is just so important to uh, support, support local. local art these in these trying times. Oh, would you agree? A call to action. A call to action. A, a legal obligation. That's right. Your horse is loud. That fucker won't shut up. Excuse me. 
That little guy, little feller. <laughs> oh, little guy. He's a pretty short horse. Is that because you're afraid of hats? Yeah, of course. Smart. I would have gotten a damn skateboard if I could. <laughs> What's that, Pilon? You're confusing well, me, Pilon, and breaking my <laughs> immersion. <laughs> from context clues, it's a little board that skates around. We got uh, <laughs> ice skates, don't we? They seem rudimentary. Do we have those? I can't remember. All right, you got me. That sounds real. <laughs> yeah, well, it is. How about I go over there and, and get a horse as a little fun little adventure? I bet I c How much you want to bet, Pilon, I can, I can sneak up on one of those horses and, and, and capture it? Bet you can't. Oh, hey, I'm going to do it. I'll bet you. I'll put ten bucks on it. Ten bucks you heard. Got my rope out. Alright, well, at least I can kill a skunk. <laughs> oh well. What can, you, what can you do? Oh! <laughs> Whoa! Dang! Pilon! Where'd he go? There you are. Well, I didn't catch the horse, but I did catch something that looks an awful lot like you. Hey, now. <laughs> oh, dirty skunk. You've gone and made me mad. <laughs> You've gone and made me mad. Don't you hate how we rip <laughs> the skin right off like a sociopath in this world? I always hated <laughs> that uh, action. Uh, it's quite grotesque, and I don't believe uh, and most people possible. can do that. Yeah, <laughs> it's like peeling an orange. Maybe you can ride Here's a Winona it. now. And do you owe me ten dollars, or or no? <laughs> I suppose I do. Thanks for pointing that out. <laughs> just now, check it. Just check it. <laughs> you got me. You got me. Let me find my money bags. Now this is interesting too. I'm in the in the I'm pouring through uh, decisions of things I could do. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And I found stances where you can do Stance. things that'll that you can walk around while while you're acting out. I can be coughing and walking. Oh wow. Okay. Oh, what's all that then? Is that just while flexing your F6 muscle? Yep, then animations, then mixed two, <laughs> then stance. Mixed two stance. I can even dance and walk. I can even, I'm dancing and coughing. <laughs> Hell yeah. Those people, uh, never mind, I was going to make a joke that won't be possible for another hundred years. I'll keep quiet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't see these stances. Hmm. Animations mixed to stance at the top. Mixed to, I didn't listen. I just click mix. Oh, here we go. Sen puke. Scenarios. Broom, bartender. Stoic trumpet. I didn't do anything. 
<laughs> well, I guess there's no trumpet in the West. You seem very sick, Pilon. That is just the magic of acting. I actually <laughs> feel quite fine. <laughs> You're such a good actor. Now I am drinking a coffee. Never mind, I'm sweeping, I guess. <laughs> You still have not quite gotten the hang of this acting thing. This is a, you're making types of mistakes I'm not familiar with seeing actors make. I just mix up the word coffee and broom quite a I lot. I think it's your object work <laughs> that you're struggling with. Yeah. I need to har ground. harness that. You're sitting on the ground. I'll sweep up beside you. There you go. Thank you. Thank you kindly. Should we think of Clean some good sitting area? Some good emotes for Romeo and Juliet. There's got to be like a oh no, because are we just doing the balcony scene, the big number? No, nah, we're doing all four acts. <laughs> all four acts. This Don't is you our think... biggest best play yet? I do believe we put in a letter to somebody, <laughs> to someone or other. I, I don't know. I just think we might lose the, 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 the folks around here are a bit, let's say, kindly uneducated. And they might not sure. necessarily stick around for the whole number, but maybe for the big finale. We just skip all the emotional context and jump right to the death? Hmm. A little or we could, do, <laughs> we could do the whole entire 4X. Well, you, the qu problem is you need people to care about these two that are jumping off this deck. They do need to hear. Maybe we could do, uh, how do I say Spark Notes version in Old West? A quick, uh, a quickie number <laughs> version. We could, and here's an idea. What about a previously on, where we give kind oh. of a montage sizzle reel? We'll jump through a few iconic moments in rapid fire. Not and even could be disconnected from which one another. Wait. Noted. I like that. And then we do the big scene, the big finale, Romeo and Juliet, that puts Shakespeare on the map. Yeah, who'd heard of him as? Dirty bastard before that big scene. I cannot stop son of a bitch. sweeping. <laughs> let me turn this. Let me turn off my arm. You stop got really it, lost arm. in this coffee drinking character. There we go. I was a, a bartender or something. I hear my belly rumbling. My thoughts are telling me in the corner of my eye. Let me. <laughs> you talk funny. <laughs> let me eat a little bit. Oh, of... I got my lasso back. Hey, or, where was it? I mean, more likely, I never lost it. You silly just goose. Didn't see it there. I am indeed a silly goose. Maybe I should eat all this meat. I've been catching of varmints and such. I thought I had a tin of some little food or something or other. A little salmon meal. I'll eat this string stringy meat. That sounds appetizing. Yum. Oh, I won't Yum. even my standards are too high apparently. I won't eat it. I can't eat a hay cube. That's for my no, horse. No, that's hay's for horses, as the <laughs> saying I just invented goes. You've been coming up with all kinds of crazy sayings. I'm an inventor. That's my second thing. <laughs> Your second thing? My second thing. Emote meal. My second thing is woman. <laughs> oh, that's a mighty fine secondary characteristic. <laughs> that's all I can do about what's around here. How did the um, first acts of Romeo and Juliet even go? Well, let's remember together. Let's remember. When did you last see Romeo and Juliet? It's gotta be... Mm, well, probably about ten years ago. Wow. Today? Ten years ago exactly today. Wow. It was an anniversary. At, I went with my mother and she was killed afterwards. Oh, that's significant. Yeah, she had pearls on her neck, and the guy ripped them off. And I, I feel like in the future, someone will use that as an idea for another superhero story or something. But it was very specific well, to me inventing. and traumatic. Now who's inventing? I'm inventing some stuff. It's not really inventing. I mean, that happened to me, and my mom died. But yeah, I guess I invented how much it affects me. <laughs> yeah, you invented grief, <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. Now, what so. do you say? Let's fish. Keep playing. Wow. Here's a big one, though. I caught a big one. You're good <laughs> at these. I just broom. I just use broom. You still have a broom on your hand, as far as I can tell. I do? Oh, my God. It's on my back. 
No, that's my gun. <laughs> I always been mixing them up. <laughs> it's dark here. So perhaps uh, we could meet at a dance. That's that happens in Romeo and Juliet, of course. Okay, yeah. So I'm thinking back ball. in my my mind. So uh, Romeo was a Montague. Do you remember that? Of course. And Juliet was and a Juliet. Capulet. The Capulet. And their families are all pissed. They're like, I hate you, I hate you. And then uh, Romeo you goes to a party at Juliet's house, and they fall in love. And then they're like, let's get married, that'd be fun. And then someone named Tybalt shows up? I don't remember that. Uh, Romeo says, I won't fight. And <laughs> how, then... how may I ask did you say that if you did not remember it? <laughs> it's just coming to me. It's just coming to me in my mind's Ty eye. Tybalt was the bad guy, was he not? Uh, yeah, Juliet's cousin Tybalt, it challenges Romeo, you see? And Romeo says, I will not fight you. And then Romeo's friend, Maturcio, I think is how I thought it Radicchio? was said. Maturcio? Maturcio? Ooh, look at this performance. I feel like I what did you can just do? the man. Oh, he's so upset. That'd be perfect for finding me dead. And That's then, called sob. Oh, perfect. You better save that one. That's a good one to save. Thank one. you. There's something sneaky going on over there, Pila. Seems like High Balth and the rest will most likely just be referenced. <laughs> they might just be off stage uh, references. <laughs> <laughs> kind of just the two of us. That's true. What is going on over there? Oh! <gasps> we gotta work that into one. Oh, what was that one called? That was called Shot, but I can't help myself from laughing at the end of it. That one I don't like. <laughs> That's a little weird that you, you, you know, laugh like, at the I'm end. I'm trying to take it seriously. I just can't. I just can't. Howdy, partner. Oh, what's up? Oh, what's, what's up? What you doing around here? We Howdy. are practicing for a play. Oh, that's... Oh. Uh, you know, I'm not, I'm not much of a guy that does plays myself. But that's crazy. Thank you. I have a buddy. Actually, you know what? I have a buddy. I have a buddy. Actually, give me a second. I think that's in there. Oh, howdy. Howdy. We're just We're talking practicing for a play, bro. You'd love for that. A play. play. We're putting on a play yeah. in Strawberry in about 20 minutes here. What kind of play? A rendition of Romeo and Juliet. Are you familiar? Oh, shit. Yeah, my mom and my pa used to act that out all the time. Oh, no. Ah. I hope they're doing okay nowadays. If you catch my drift, <laughs> uh, no one's ending. No, they're dead. Oh dear, Everyone I'm very sorry. Dead. No, oh, it's no. okay. They were, they were some, they were some nasty bastards. That's all good. They were nasty bastards. Well, that, at least they're gone if they're nasty bastards. Yeah, yeah. But uh, what time in Straw? You said about twenty minutes. That's twenty right. minutes on the dot. All right, we're gonna try to make it up there for that then. Fantastic. Is there like a, is there like a entry fee? No, free, free. But gratuity oh, is, is, is appreciated. But it's absolutely free to attend. That's right, oh, yeah, but your gratitude uh, is we go a long way. I think I said yeah, that wrong. We will, uh, we'll, I got negative uh, $3.67. I'll we'll, try and donate yeah, as much free. as I can. <laughs> I feel that, partner. I feel that. We'll, no uh, we'll be in town for it, all right? All right. We can't wait it. to see you there. See then. Yeah, yeah, be safe till then. You guys be safe, too. What nice fellers. Well, that's fantastic. Lovely, lovely Ooh. fellers. Perhaps we'll need a big kiss. We'll blow. Oh, that's romantic. Oh, that's, that's perfect. Romantic. Where did you find that immediately? Tell me. That's called Flying Kiss. Flying Kiss. Let me find it. It's under Mix 2 again. Uh, I'm doing it from the Manage Emote uh, <laughs> cortex of my brain. <laughs> oh, the upper cortex. Gotcha, gotcha. That's right. Frontwards cortex. <laughs> Frontwards cortex. <laughs> exactly. Uh, Pilon, I thought they were going to rob us. I have been delighted by the kindness of strangers. <laughs> no, I was like, oh, they're going to kill us a thousand percent. And then they just were like, we can't wait to come to your show. I was like, wow. This is about as creepy of an area we could be in. And the first guy who came up did have a witch's hat covering his entire head. So and he, then he said, I have a friend who I should go get, which is never good. Never go to the second <laughs> no. location is what my mama said. We're talking red flag number four at this point. <laughs> and I just said, oh, I hope this works out. You know what I kind of think will happen? If you're if you're charismatic enough, if you're spunky and fun, I feel like you get pardoned with all the with the violence side of this of this area. 
If you're not looking for trouble, trouble won't be made of you. That's what my mom always taught me, and she was an important figure in my backstory. In your back? Is that what you call your childhood? <laughs> your backstory? Sure, tomato, tomato. Tomato, tomato. Tomato, tomato. All right, so I got that one. What about, let me search. You said sob? That seemed like a good one. Oh, yeah, there we go. Let me see that one. Oh, no, Romeo, no! Oh, I even, <laughs> I even make a sound. That's pretty cool. Oh, per can you lie down, Dad? Oh, oh, oh. I mean, can I'm going to jump off down, that freaking balcony. I have, probably will lay down for a little bit. What about die? If I just type die. Okay, nothing comes up. I mean, type. What, what am I saying? <laughs> oh, I'm tired. Uh, <laughs> how do I just do this? That was a cute, that was a nice little dance one. Thank you. I'm All right, using glad. Whence we meet. You stink. Let's fish. Amaze. Thumbs down. Spin and aim. Joyful laugh. Look distance. Prayer. Prayer might joyful be good. Laugh might be if you got something to spare. Joyful. Oh, prayer of course. Well, sob and prayer, I believe, are interchangeable for the scene's work. All right, I'll do that. I'll select that one as one that I'm going to do. And listen, Prospector Jig. Maybe in the future, not for this particular show. I don't think it's that... It's not, not befitting of your character. <laughs> not befitting of Juliet to do a, a excitable <laughs> Prospector's Jig. If I'm finding I mean, I don't dead know Romeo. which rendition, you, which interpretation of the text you've seen, but... Spit. It's not present in mind. Except by the sex guy, the one who's fucking a lot. What is cock snook? Excuse me. That is what this is called. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little bit of a I'm a little bastard doing that one. <laughs> Screw you, old man. <laughs> you sure acting all right, all right, acting like a little bastard. That's a little bastard. Uh, can you sweep again or something? I'd love this broom to not be on your hand for the big performance. <laughs> I don't see it on my hand. I think I think I, you You know, I understand that, but I just for me, for my peace of mind, I'm asking you just this simple thing. All right, I will do that. Uh, let me just choose my last thing I want to do. Tough. Beg for mercy. That seems good. Beck and shrug. That seems good. Take notes, scared. Howl! Hush your mouth. Nod head. How dare you? Let's go, sob. Surrender, thanks. I don't think I have a dying thing in, that I can do, but there's that other dying one and the other one I can use. Well, great. I'll do that. So, do you have a lay down one? I think I'll have to do... Here's what I think. So I can't find it in the front cranium manage emote. Cranium front sack. Cranium, um, but what I can find is if I do the bottom cranium and then I say... I'm pretty sure it's under mixed. Wow. It's, it's incredible watching you in your mind palace <laughs> at the moment. Uh, I hope games... In the future, we'll have mind palaces to do things. <laughs> and I bet that's a really good trope that games will, will like to include. Game, like a, think car, the things you do with cards and dice? <laughs> yeah, like a mind palace for the, some dice. To really think <laughs> about it. Actions. Now that is the... Oh, here's Morn. Horses pajamas. Look at Morn. <laughs> Look at Morn. <laughs> Hello. Look at this little number. Uh, that's <laughs> under actions. And then there's pissed, caught, hostage, surrender over and here. And do you have a bow for the end? Do you have a bow ready for the end? Uh, yeah. The fancy bow. I don't have it ready in an emote. Let me do that. What did I just did say? That. I meant ready in my thoughts. Yeah. Fancy bow, right? That's what we like to call it. That's what we like to call it. Now, fancy. here's one more thing. I think we do need to head into town soon to start drumming up hype for the oh, play. Oh, yeah. And but the th last thing I think we need to really sort out is the logic of the jumping off. That's a big, big uh, change from the poison scene. Yeah. Uh, so. I reckon people will. Oh yeah, how are we gonna figure that out? So I guess maybe you oh, could. I, well, yeah, no, no. I find you dead and I, lying, and I think you're poisoned, and I jump off, and then you wake up and you okay. see that I jumped off, and you jump off, right? So, yeah, and I was just sleeping the whole time like an idiot. You're just snoozing. That's what, Shakespeare, you know, he's a famous guy around here, but 
But I think that is a huge plot hole. I know. Why didn't he not simply say, are you asleep to his beloved? Said, Wake her up. <laughs> said, I That's what I was it. saying when I, when I saw this performance last week. Okay, there's one called Hurt. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Dying. Meow. <laughs> That's what I look like, a little cat. You do look like a cute little cat. Okay, this is dying. So it kind of looks like I'm sleeping or dying. So you could do this one or you could do the limp noodle thing. I'm going to limp noodle off the off the deck. That's how I'm going to handle it. All right, and I'll do this to pretend I'm sleeping and then I'll jump off the deck afterwards. Fantastic, fantastic. And then we'll just end with a big fancy bow and get up from there. Perfect. Perfect. All right, stop this death. Let me practice diving and getting back up. <laughs> okay, you practice. That's a hard one. Oh god, I didn't quite wasn't watching. <laughs> that was a, that was a good one. Thank you. Let me try too. I didn't even. F oh, I see. You did the limp noodle in midair. I did, and I'm having trouble getting back up, which I was afraid of. <laughs> well, maybe I shouldn't do it either. Here, what no, about we gotta learn? We gotta. Learn. Can I pick? Oh, there you go. Well, that's interesting. But if we're both limp. I don't see a way out of it. How do you go limp again? Z. <laughs> I think flex your Z muscle. These pratfalls are... I feel talented at this, by the way. <laughs> just gonna say that the, the physical comedy of watching that happen just now really got me. <laughs> I'm giving it my all. I'm not blocking my head whatsoever. I'm not quite as good as you at that. It is How hard to get, get up. up? <laughs> oh, just press... Press that again, or what if we click stop? Oh, we both. I see can't pull up that cortex, but just pressing Z again worked after a moment. I, think. <laughs> I can't pull up that cortex. Yeah. Yes, pressing Z. There's about a second delay. I mean, thinking Z, flexing your Z mode, whatever. The fuck. <laughs> All right, here oh, I go. I'm gonna try works. again. Oh. Nah, that wasn't as good. I got up right away there. All right, Pilon. I reckon we should probably get into town. We got. <laughs> I reckon we should get into town. Let's do it. Oh, nice one. Thank you. That felt my I best. I hope we do not die. I hope we do not die. That's I what I'm mean, saying. We're going to have to ask if there's a doctor in the audience, which would be kind of comical in of itself. Get up, myself. Get up. There we go. I find if I just... I find you got to flex the Z muscle and wait. And you and don't press it multiple times or nothing. Just press gotcha. it and wait a second. That's All right. How do you get your hat back, Pilon? Oh, I think I think I actually know how to do that. I go to clothing, and I click on hat. Mine came back by itself real right quick. I did it. I'm learning how to live in this world. How'd you bring it back? If you go flex your F6 muscle, and then you go to clothing, you can toggle. I mean, you can take on and off your clothes in a moment's instance. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I never considered doing that, but I guess that is an option available to me. Thank you. Yeah, we should also be marketing on our way there, any any fellers we see. Fella to fella marketing. I like it. <laughs> door to door, but on the road. The dirt path team for Shakespeare's Lothario. Yeah, we, let's never look up what that means. I just, wouldn't even know how. And just enjoy. Enjoy being in the moment. That's <laughs> <laughs> a Great outlook. How many tips do you think we're going to get this time around, Pilon, if you had to guess? It depends how many people in Strawberry. I, I do not know if this is an occupied town or not, or one that's kind of abandoned. Yeah, I might have to maybe run around and get collect up some fellers up. Looks Are like you okay, Lion, that we put on three episodes of Romeo and Juliet already in the past? Lion? Oh, yeah, I mean... Why are we saying Unless that we we've did it done it three times? For the previous Leon. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. That's a lie. Yeah, I'm fine with that. <laughs> I'm fine with lying. Let's do a lap. See who's in town. Are you real feller? Real interested in theater? Nope. Fake feller. Fake feller. Fake feller. Oh, dear Pilon! I'm going to go ahead and get off my horse. Don't abandon her. Yeah, she's good. She's Hello, freaking sir. out. Hello, sir. Hello. 
Are we're you guys interested in plushies, canes, or maybe some boxing gloves? Are you guys interested in any of that? That's a fun combo of things. We're, we're actually going to ask you something if you're interested in theater. In, in the theater? In the theater. That's right. What you, what's going on over there? I'm interested. I'm in. I'm game. We're, we're putting on a performance of Romeo and Juliet up there at the, at the Strawberry Hotel in just about seven minutes here. In seven minutes here at the Strawberry Hotel? Yes, sir. Oh, cool. No way. Yes, I way. will be ready. Where is the theater at? Uh, we're going to do it at the Strawberry Hotel just up the street here. Right here in town. Oh, okay. Yeah, hope to see you there. Oh, we're going to be there. Fantastic. Right, have a blessed day. Someone else over here. <laughs> I got right. you running around. Howdy. We're doing a show right here to your rat. At the hotel in about five, seven minutes. Well, this is the welcome center. The hotel is. Oh, this is. Oh, there's two hotels, isn't there? There's two hotels. Yeah, yeah. There's one over here, right across the oh, bridge shoot. here. So we and want the welcome center. Right. Yep. Wrap the Tracker's on? hotel looks good too. Looks like a mighty fine. Ooh, what do you think? Which one? Porch. A little more space up here on this one. I think we can get on it if we climb from the back. Oh, I'll show you how to get up there. You want me to show you how to get up there? Perfect. Yes, please. Let's do it. <gasps> wow. Ooh. A little sneaky way. <laughs> wow. Elon, that was close. I ain't climbed like this since I was a young little spring onion. <laughs> little spring onions. How the hell are you doing this? <laughs> Jump it! There we go. Nicely done. Thank you. Yeah, I reckon this is better. I'm just gonna try something right quick. Perfect. <laughs> it looked amazing. <laughs> <laughs> perfect, perfect. No spoilers, no spoilers. No spoilers. For the Let's do a lap and oh, all right. time. Yeah, we're go we'll be right back, fellas. Alrighty. You wanna do I'll go further out of town with Winona P Long. Yeah, take your guys' time. Come back with the crowd. We will we'll be we'll, here. We'll go find some fellers. Thank you. All right. Let me see. <laughs> it's nice. I love this so much. <laughs> he runs over here. I don't see anybody peeling. I'll go do a loop. I'll ride out a little bit. Sounds good. All right. Let me see if I find anybody. Howdy! Yeah, how's it going? We just wanted to let you know that there's a play going on in Strawberry in about five minutes! What the fuck? There's a play! <laughs> yeah, there's oh, a, yeah? a play of Romeo oh, and Juliet my. at the hotel in Strawberry. Goddamn. We hope to see you we there! Can't, we can't go to Tumbleweed. We have to go watch <laughs> the play! I okay. love your matching outfits, by the way. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you! We'll be there. Sounds good! <laughs> so fun. Excuse me, feller! What the hell? Alright. Don't know what that was about. That was a bit weird. <laughs> Got our show in about four minutes. My belly's rumbling. I don't reckon I see anybody else. I should probably go back. Yeah, I reckon no one else out here. All right, I'll head back. I only got about three minutes till the play starts. Make sure I get it back in time. I thought that was a person. Bro, 
Romeo and Juliet in just about three minutes right here at this very hotel. We'd love to see you in the crowd if you like. Entry are completely free. Okay, cool. Thank you kindly. Happy line, mm -hmm. I found a couple more people. They're coming. They're coming. I couldn't find too many people though. No, I, as long as those two fellers, kindly fellers we ran into in the dead of night come, I think we'll have a pretty good turnout here. <laughs> dead of night. Oh yeah, but they're gonna be late. They better, they better hurry. They better hurry. What do you say we get up there and do a little snake dance pre-show for the fine folks? <laughs> Fantastic idea, Pilon. Good thing you got your rope. That's right. No more trailers for us. We, we graduate to the dance academy. All right, uh, from henceforth, oh. I'm going to be pro projecting my voice fully. I've been doing that the whole time. I'm loud <laughs> <right>. as sin. <laughs> Let me... Oh, that one second, P-Long. Let me know when you're ready, and I'll count us in. All right. Get my rope out here. And let me flex the right muscle. <laughs> oh, we got a few different people down there, P-Long. All right, I'd love to see it. Uh, And that was under... Let me see... Apologize. It's been <laughs> a while. Giving thanks to the Lord. <laughs> I love to see some Christian folks in the audience. Now, don't be, don't be dismissive of the others. Now. Here All right. I'd love to see any religion. You're all set. <laughs> I'm ready. And a one, and a two, and a one, two, three, four. Perfect. All right. This is a little pre-show for y'all. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Woo! everybody, for coming out and supporting local PA. Thank you for supporting local. <laughs> this is called the Snake Dance. Something we picked up on our travels. Learning to be big show folk. ranchers. <laughs> oh, what a fantastic crowd we got going already. What a good Woo! turnout so far. Welcome, come on in. This is here's the pre-show. We'll be going live with the main show in about two minutes. I only came over here because I heard yelling. We are yelling, right. like all and actors do. Oh uh, yeah. In theater, we call it projecting, sir. Yes. Yes. Damn, Damn right, people. Ellie, I'm up on the roof. What? Oh, I hit you right. Look at you. What a perfect <laughs> seat. That's incredible, and you can hear us fine from over there? Uh, yeah, sure can. I'm Perfect. projecting right now. Can you hear me? They're That's learning! Right. Well, you just might have a future in the theater. They learn how to project. That's that's phase one. We did have a couple RSVPs we're still waiting on here, but uh, we won't keep y'all waiting much longer. Nah. Want to give them, you know, if they were serious about attending, they, I'm sorry, this is private, this is personal stuff. I don't need to, I don't need to rant y'all about this. <laughs> keep it, keep it level, P Long. Keep you it know level. what? We're keep here. Like, That's what matters. Like. You're it's absolutely true. right. The folks that did show up, I am overjoyed and grateful. This is gonna be fucking amazing. <laughs> That's right. Heck, heck yeah. That's absolutely right. Awesome. A play. Uh, Romeo and Juliet. I'm still on it now. Any Shakespeare yeah. fans in the audience? Whoa! <laughs> yeah, we got one at least. All right, I love to hear that. Real Shakespeare. I would be, head. but I don't know how to read. I just like watching. Oh, that's okay, fair. It for you, honey. We're trying to make that's Shakespeare fair. accessible to all. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> There's a lot of weird words too. Yeah, we don't. We kind of skip over them big words. We just. Uh, oh like no, to... I'm gonna try to use them. All right. Well, oh. Elon, if Elon's gonna use them, I'll use them. There's Hell gonna be yeah. some vows. There's gonna be some here fors. Gonna Nobody be some o's. Great. Gonna be them some vas. <laughs> All right. But I do reserve the right to drop it, of course, if that's not working. All right, Elon, should like we get started? I don't think our SVPs are showing up. Sad face. That's quite all right. All right. Everyone, thank you so much for coming out. Thank you for coming. Now, <laughs> Romeo and Juliet is quite an epic yarn, you understand. And you are joining us in our fourth of four mighty performances. We offer you now a previously on to catch you up on the story of Romeo and Juliet.
up to where we join our two lovers for this final act. Thank you, P. Long. Previously on Romeo and Juliet, Romeo, a handsome devil he was, went to a party and found himself infatuated with the beautiful Juliet. Unfortunately, their families were at war and hated each other. No! Ro it's just awful. Romeo is a Montague and Juliet is a Capulet. And their parents just plum Tucker hate each other. They say, you stink, you stink. And they fight, fight, fight. Oh, my God. So, sorry, huh? sorry for if there are any children in the audience. Sorry, this should have warned you this does get quite scary. It's a bit scary. They're fighting. And then anyway, so Romeo goes to a party in disguise to see Juliet again. And don't they just fall in love? They do. They say, oh, you're the best. You're the best. Kiss, kiss, kiss. And they just fall in love. Dancing together. Dance, dancing dance, together dance. on the dance floor, Romeo and Juliet. But as we all know, Romeo and Juliet isn't a comedy. It's a drama. So something's Which about... Which means sad. For those who aren't sad. too learned in the crowd, drama means it gets sad. Yeah, remember the two masks and the happy one that. and the small, the sad one? That's where the sad ones. So let's, right. let's get going and see how this tale turns. Oh, Juliet. Oh, I do love you. Mwah, Juliet. Oh, I love you too, Romeo. Nothing could ruin this. This is absolutely perfect. No notes. I want to continue living like this forever. I have no notes either. Mwah. My only concern is with that evil cousin Tybalt I got who's always so messing stuff up. Do you think he's going to have any problems with us? Or do you think he'll let us live our lives the way we intend? He was so kind and forgiven. He even dropped off this nice bottle of mineral water for you to be drinking from. Oh, well. Why don't you take a sip? I would love to take a sip. Wonderful. I'm gonna go for a walk. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you leave I while I. Head. You leave while I drink this. Let me drink this delicious drink. And I think oh, she's enjoying her beverage. It's so delicious. I think I'm just gonna have a little nap. Honey, I've thought about it, and I think we should buy that horse again. Excuse me, honey, Juliet. Juliet! Juliet, no, Juliet, wake up! Oh my lord. Oh my lord, she is dead! Oh, my Juliet is dead! Oh! No! I've known her all of 80 minutes across three days and my life is forfeit without her! Oh, this is a tragic day! Oh this day truly sucks, thou ass! Oh, what purpose is there for living without my Juliet? What purpose indeed? Juliet, I'm coming to join you, honey. Oh! Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> you hurt myself, Juliet. But not bad enough. Let me, give me just a moment, Juliet. Oh, I'm still coming to join you. I just got a little sidetracked. Okay, here I come. Oh, my God. Oh, that was a refreshing nap. Hmm, yawn. Wait a sec. Romeo! Romeo, where for art thou, Romeo? Oh my god. This cannot be. This cannot be my Romeo! <laughs> he don't fall right off this banister and died. Why would he do that instead of just asking me to wake up? Oh, Lord above! Please hear my plea. Let me join Romeo in the afterlife forever. No! <laughs> the is that end! I was there they did. The end! It, it is that sad. <laughs> it is <laughs> that sad. Let me just Run collect my. Boss. Thank Come on you. up. Come on up, Sierra. The um, lovely Sierra Sage, of course, playing Juliet today. Let's give it a big hand for her. It's been a long what? day. Amazing. Let me just collect my thoughts and get up here. Uh, I think she really did hurt herself. I think oh God! I, I'm okay. Uh, this happens in the theater. Get up, beam! Come on, legs! Okay. Work, work, work! Book. There we go! Oh, there we go! <laughs> there we are! Thank you all so much for coming out tonight. I have been Keylon Vaughn playing Romeo for you. 
We are a traveling theater troupe on our way to San Denis. We hope to catch y'all at a future show. Our shows are always free, but gratuities oh are included. My lucky number is Are you is guys headed to San Denis right now? Yours is 909. <laughs> we, hope, we hope to, yeah. Oh, are my. you guys going to have another God. show? I'm giving you all my money right now. <laughs> That's That's appreciate right. it. plenty of shows. This is Wait, are you guys? Do you guys are you guys going to the theater next, like in Saint Denis, or where can I catch you guys at? Oh, we would love to get booked in that theater. Here's hoping they'd let us do a show in there. What's so your far. What, what, what's your number, sir? Nine one six. And thank you so much, sir, for your tip. Already. Split that between. Split that between you two. Thank you. I will. Thank you so much. Thank you. He you handles the us. money. I'm not allowed to have any kind of money until probably. Of <laughs> oh, thank you. No shit. Hey, Around 1960, job, we'll get that sorted out, I reckon, but no money for her at the moment. Thank you, thank you. This, You guys were our best audience yet, eh, P-Long? <laughs> Absolutely. Well, you Y'all fucking deserve it. You guys were amazing. Thank, thank you. you so much, man. We do hope incredible, to see incredible. you soon. You guys should swing around Strawberry a little more. We will. Oh, yeah. This is our first All time right. playing oh, yeah. here. It's been our best show so far. You have I think you have like a perfect spot right there, yeah. Performance. yeah thank you very much. It's building. actually the house of our mayor. Yes, the mayor's Oops. Oops. better. I hope yeah, he doesn't so mind us fine. jumping from his balcony. Nah, I think no, he'd be fine with that. All right. As long as you choose not to sue him, then I think he'll be all right. He's a lover yeah. of the arts. Mm hmm, absolutely. We have to respect that. We you put know a what? new word Do you to think we could talk break a leg, to AP Long? Mr. Pinkman <laughs> about uh, including some theater to the city? <gasps> a residency? <laughs> What do you uh, think, Chuck? He's, 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 a cheap, he's a cheap fuck, I mean, but I'll talk to him about it. You guys, Hell you guys, yeah. you guys like theater or like stage theater or like... Oh, deals. We hmm. love every type of theater. Saint, okay. if, if we Saint can Dini sing and dance, best. we can do it. Hell yeah. I, there is a train nearby to San Denis. Is that, is that incorrect? Is that right? Nah, it's not running right now. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay, but Rick's well, station is oh, really close. Uh, can yeah, I get tracks some of my are good to box? travel. For, uh, if the mayor wants to have us in a more permanent basis? Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, let me write that down. All right. Let me know when you're ready. All righty. I'm ready. It is 168-654. If you're writing to and him, you're writing was? to me. I'll hear it. That's right. <laughs> yep. Absolutely. Uh, what was your name? I am Pilon Vaughn, and this is Sierra Sage. Rolls off the tongue, don't it? Pilon Vaughn. Pilon Vaughn. Sierra Sage. That's right. Love y'all's matching attire. We need to take a lesson from their book, Pilon, and have matching outfits. Oh, we sure. Oh. Is that, are y'all affiliated <laughs> with any uh, group? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're the Flamingos. The Flamingos! Flamingos. All right. So, like amigo, no end. Just like, like I'm your oh, amigo, amigo, you know. Oh, like amigos. amigos, yeah. Oh, that's even better. That's even more creative. That's delightful. <laughs> no wonder y'all are the theater going artsy type. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> true. We are flamboyants. <laughs> that's true. It's learn, been an absolute pleasure meeting y'all, and we do hope to see you soon. Thank you so much for coming out. Y'all have truly been, truly been excellent. Yes, yeah, no thank problem. You. Oh, you guys yeah. be safe. Love to see you around again. Absolutely. Right. Take care. Bye. Bye. Let's call Winona. Maybe you can finally ride her again. I need to get myself a saddle. You want to do that right now? There's a stable right Ooh. down the corner. Oops. <laughs> I promise to share money with you. Let me do that route real quick. Honestly, why don't you just hold it all? We'll put it in the bank. We are going to pull it for the same uh, wagon, ain't we? Yeah, we're pulling for the same thing. A long-term financial goal. There's a stable this way if you want to buy a saddle. Be long? Yeah, lead the way. Thank you. All right. We're just consulting my map. Of course, of course. So many ponies around these parts right now. <laughs> well, that was a, a resounding success. A That's amazing. He took the words out of my mouth. Oh, God. Right? Ow! Yeah, <laughs> I think so. 
I can't seem to get up. There we go. I'm all right. Oh You're my God. Right. <laughs> no, no. Oh my Lord. <laughs> a horse revival of some kind? <laughs> I don't think so, and if there was, I don't have one. Did you hit me or hit the rock? <laughs> it was a bit of both between a rock and a pylon. Oh, no. <laughs> Maybe in a stable you can do something about her. Well, I think I want to have a quick service, but it's all right for you. I haven't quite moved on, pylon. <laughs> of course, of course. I'm sorry. Winona, you were a legend of the West. You were my favorite, favorite girl, and I will miss you until the end of time. <laughs> it's starting to rain. That's her. That's a message to sign. Oh, how fitting. Please, how Lord, look after this beautiful creature in your paradise. Please, Lord, please. Please. I can't bury her. She's too heavy. I guess we gotta just leave her on the dirty ground. <laughs> Wait. Oh my god. Okay, that don't how, work. That's how dare fine. you, honestly. <laughs> I wanted to bring her somewhere. Her body ain't even cold yet. Oh well. Bye, Winona. I blame, Bye, Winona. I blame you a little bit. Not gonna lie, Pilon. I don't blame you for that. I'll be uh, making it up to you. <laughs> For the, as long as we know each other, I suppose. That's my fi that was my best friend. I hope a carbon copy is waiting for me in this here stable. We should be so lucky. Or if I have to pay another twelve two hundred dollars. She was expensive. That was ironically quite Shakespearean, that as was. HD BBB in my thoughts says. One of my oh my! My horse was healed by a vet. I paid five dollars. I just learned in my brain. All right. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. You just remembered that? I just remembered that I had the vet insurance. And it <laughs> and it only cost five buckers to bring a horse back from the dead. And which way is is this sable from here? Oh, it's, uh, I think we passed it. It's right here. Oh. I put it on the map. Although you can't see my map. I don't know what I'm saying. It's, uh... Your paint. It's on, right underneath Strawberry. Queen of Hearts Stable. Right under the R's and Strawberry on the mat. You see it? I do. Perfect. Oh my lord. What an adventure. What an adventure. If I may ask, if it's not too soon, how much did you get tipped? I got 150. All right, I got 110. Nice. Maybe that's we... a very good, reliable amount. Of, if we keep getting that amount of money, yeah, we're made. What are you at right now, money wise? Hundred sixty on me, four fifty in the bank. So that's a total of. Hold on, in let the me. Bank. I, math was just invented, so it'll <laughs> take a minute to compute this. I math was just it's invented. It's about six hundred. Plus my two, I have two hundred and sixteen right now. All right. So we're almost halfway to our our dream state. What was it called? Uh, a dream coach. Why am I not opening my stuff I want to open? I'll go in here and then I'll do it. I reckon that'll work then. Here we go. Oh. Oh, there. Oh. Whoops. Are you going to buy a saddle? There she is, or my girl. And how do I buy a saddle? You have to go in and hold uh, your alt muscle, and then when you click on your horse you want, when you look at the horse you want, there's a thing that says tack, and you can choose under the tack options. All the different, there's a ton of different saddles. Winona. There you are, girl. You fun fought the devil in one, girl. Come here. There she is. There's my girl. 
Beauty. What a good girl. Out for bit out of business available for application soon. Oh wow. I wonder where we'll head to next. Hmm. It does warm my heart to see you back with Winona. She's my special girl. She went to the gates of hell and came trotting back out. Did you figure out your horse's name? It's Parsnip, of course. <laughs> Parsnip? I reckon I love that. Nice saddle! Thank you. A little dreamy for what are we if not dreamers. Well, what do you think, Pilon? What's the next stop for the Shakespeare Lotharios? That's a good question. I mean, Valentine's a pretty major stop. I feel it's only fitting we would go check that out on our way. I thought a train to Saint Denis might hit the spot, so to speak, but it seems there ain't one running. I guess you need a real guy running that, and there ain't one. <laughs> a real guy. Because only real guys know how to get on the tracks and get the train going. I need me a real guy. All the real guys are taken. <laughs> all of them real guys are taken. By all bandits. <laughs> yeah, all I get are soulless, eyeless NPCs. That means not particularly cool guys. <laughs> That's right. That's right. That would, If we ever say NPC again, that is what we mean. Yes, not anything else. That wouldn't make sense for this era and time. I reckon that we start on our road to Valentine. And we make a friend or two along the way. I've just thought about it a lot in this last 20 seconds, and I decided I agree. I <laughs> marked a little it. spot on our way there. It looks like there's a little settlement that might even have boats. I'd be very curious if somebody's running a boat service from there. We might see about getting a ferry to San Denis, huh? Where is that? It's just south of it. I can lead I can lead us there. Okay, yeah, you lead. That's more fun and immersive. <laughs> Great. <laughs> I love to be immersed here in my real life. <laughs> it feels good. I also want to stop at a clothing shop at some point and try to change my outfit. I want to be more theater looking. Oh, great. Yeah, that we can do that in San Denis for sure. Well, San Instead Denis, then ago, prices are going to be... reference. Remember Lincoln? Too much money in San Denis. Watch it. Don't you kill Winona again. <laughs> we'll be careful. A nice canter. That's all we need. I think not rushing will be the difference between life and death for our fair steeds. True. Is the storm going to hit in 40 minutes? It sure is. Well, we got to always sneak a play in before the big storm's done. We love a little drama like that, don't we? Well, what, what do you a reckon? little ticking clock. <laughs> yeah, we got the last second play. What do you think we should do next, having completed our Romeo and Juliet run? Hmm. That's a good question. Should we continue on the Shakespeare train, or should we do something new? What about a murder mystery? Oh, I question how thrilling that'd be with just one victim and one killer, but could be interesting. <laughs> we could play multiple people, and the audience has to... We could do audience participation! Oh, immersive theater. Yeah, we could say, listen, uh, left here? We could say, one of you's the killer. Oh, an interactive play. Now there's an idea. Multimedia, where the play is the media only. So I guess it's just one media still. <laughs> A synergized single media fun experience. <laughs> Fun is what we'll call it. Experience. I like that. That's let's let's coin that term right away for anyone Called else. Fun experience because when you experience it, you done dang have a lot of fun. You <laughs> have yeah, so much fun. There's a camp up there on that hill. Wow, you are perceptive. Thank you. <laughs> that felt ironic. I hope it was it was truthful. No, I truly do not understand with our human senses how you knew there was one there. <laughs> a little peek, a quick peek in my periphery. 
Or what are we if not two humans? That's true. That's all I am. Whoops. You okay? What happened there? Just calmly got off my horse a little bit. I'm back on now. I'm back on. We have to say howdy to every person we meet. New rule. And ask them their favorite play. Get some ideas, maybe. One of my many personalities, and Hedron, just said, Have y'all heard of Sherlock Holmes? What if we did a Sherlock Holmes? Ooh, Mr. Holmes. Like, he's got recognition. He does. People like him. All right, we could do one of those, and I could be your assistant, Dr. Watson. Oh, immersive theater where I'm Sherlock and you're Watson, and we're figuring out who in the theater crowd did the killing? Oh, that sounds actually fun, and that should be an actual play in real life. I mean, not just in our <laughs> own imaginations. Right now, and we'll do the play in a moment. <laughs> it should be a thing in this reality and in any all. reality even more real than this. Exactly. If there are any. What could be more real? But I understand what you mean. Right. I can do... Can I do a flying kiss while riding oh it glitches me through my winona my body <laughs> yeah my winona glitch oh you did well you i did. believe you can in your cortex uh select the upper body version and that i might work. did notice that i guess oh. that's what that's for yeah i never thought about okay. it though i was like why is there only one version howdy oh. howdy oh Who's... howdy oh the lights are on but no one's home might be an unoccupied little settlement here. I'll check the saloon. If there's anybody in town, that's where they'll be, I reckon. All right, sounds good. Oh, he opened the door. This is eerie. <laughs> this is pretty dark and dungy. All right, we don't got much time to lollygag around if we want to get another immersive theater play in before the storm comes. True. To Valentine! Or the boat place first, I guess. Or is this the boat place, he thought? While we're stopped here, why don't we get our detective uh, gestures set? Smart. I think there was actually a couple. Where were they? There was one, I think it was I See You or something. Let me look, let me look. That would be a good one. What the heck is that sound? Do you hear that sound? There's creepy noises around this area. <laughs> I don't uh, like that. That's baked in, yeah. Should I let Watson do a prospector jig? You reckon that would be funny? <laughs> <laughs> I think that could has potential to get a big laugh. All right, here we go. This is what it would look like. Oh, Watson, uh, Sherlock Holmes, let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. You know, I think that is a little, uh, what you call it, hack. But I think <laughs> if we're playing for tips, there's nothing wrong. Nothing wrong with, with doing uh, what we can. Pandering a little bit. You know, if you're do if you're Sherlock, smoke cigarette would be a good one for you. It's very contemplative. Oh, I wish they had a pipe. Could I smoke a pipe? Check pocket watch seems very Sherlock Holmes. Oh, you are right. What is that fucking sound? It's terrifying me. Sorry for the there swears. There are... I, I have heard legend of this place. There are ghosts. There are ghosts here. I hate it. Should I really make Dr. Watson my own and instead of him being this, the very serious, I'm just a, a freaking idiot? Like, I could also use this one. <laughs> yeah, just, perhaps you're more of a Igor type. Igor, I like that. Air Banjo, that could also work for this kind of character. My Sherlock Holmes is gonna find the killer, gonna find the killer right now. <laughs> That's great. I mean, Valentine, look, we're out here in the dead of night in the middle of nowhere. I could say this. The people the of Valentine here, yeah. are not the brightest bunch. Oh, they're the dumbest in all the West. I think if, oh, is there farting? Could we work some farts oh. in? Anything of that, anything kind of that low brow humor, I think might take us further in Valentine. I got, I mean, I got this classic one. <laughs> now, if you taunt them, they are also quite violent. I that's believe true, that is that's the two true. main character traits. The dichotomy at war within each Valentinian's mind. Valentinian. All right, yeah, that's fair. How about, uh, what's this one here? 
Spin it aim. Not really applicable to this particular play. Not quite applicable. <laughs> it's kind of something cool. Uh, Cox nuke. Snot rocket. Now that sounds silly. Yuck. I won't do that again. I'm thinking for this performance, I'll play the victim at the start and die and then reemerge as Sherlock Holmes. Oh, very smart. Very smart. How, and we'll I, just pretend your corpse is there the whole time. I find I think we're on to something with these with these stunts. The jumping off. I People feel like, like that's that. a big crowd pleaser. <laughs> that is the big crowd pleaser. So oh, I could be a shadowy figure who pushes you off a ledge. And then we figure out who it is. Hmm, that's interesting. Well, I, that might just be confusing for because it's got to be one of them. But I could we just say, who, I'm you. not myself. I'm a spooky figure. I could do I'm this. See? Arr. That's pretty good. <laughs> How about that? I'll, we'll make that just crystal clear what's going on there. That's fine. We can sell that. That's fine. Although, okay. again, they are, they are not the brightest bunch. They might have trouble wrapping their heads around it. But I think, you know, we can only diminish our art so much. Here's a question for you. Say we figure out the, who the killer is and we say to them, oh, it was you. We caught you. Do you think it would cause a stir if we were to to lasso them as a big finale? Oh. Do you think people would take offense to that in the rules of this world? Oh, a snake. Snake. There's just a snake. I'm... Might that get us in trouble? It might, but I feel like we've been getting away with murder because we're so charming. I feel like people <laughs> might let us do whatever the hell we want around these parts. But remember, if you hogtie, it will destroy your lasso. Oh, roasted. Well, I could just do the throw-in thing and then let him go. Not actually yeah. tie up. Yeah, hold him there, but don't tie him up. Yeah, we can. We and can then give pretend a we, and we then... got him for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so yeah. how are we gonna like layer it so we know who did it? Um, we'll have to grill him. We'll be asking him questions, and I guess probably like the fourth or fifth guy. <laughs> just whoever's fourth <laughs> or fifth. All right, that could work. But so, this, I am losing confidence in it a little bit that I'll be able to keep track of a whole mystery. Uh, maybe I'm only lying. three people from the audience. And number two, how about we just agree? Number two will be who did it, and we just use whatever silly context clues to make it sound like it's the truth. But so we'll come back to number two. Oh, it's, it's going to be number two who did it, and whatever they say, just make it seem like they're the murderer. All right. So that at least we're on the here, same the page. Take a lift. Oh, okay. Hang a lift. Oh, watch oh, it. Me. Watch it. <laughs> There's so, Valentine on the ridge. So you know what we could do is we could say, we know who the killer is, and we'll say it in one, two, three, and then we'll both go, number two, and then they'll think that we're in big, we're like, oh, wow, they're Amazing. really on the same page. Yeah, we'll, we'll have to get their names, too. We'll have to ask them their names. Yeah, okay. Oh, no, the There's storm. There's our 30-minute timer. The storm's coming. We got half an hour, though. I mean, we could even fit two shows in. Well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Let's see what happens. Sorry, I'm trying to min-max our <laughs> profits. <laughs> that, those words have no relevance to me. <laughs> those words haven't been invented yet and will never be good. I reckon this town will be busy. I'm sure. I'm going dis to dismount my horse. Okay. Oh, look here, Pilon. How about this first stage? How about this? I had a friend who did a stand-up special here. Oh, your friend. I heard about that. And was it a success? Uh, they did try to hang him numerous times throughout the performance. Not Apropos. I, uh, think of it. Apropos. Apropos. I want to practice my dying thing really quick while we're here. All so right. It's just, how can I not? It's the most perfect distance. All right, ready? <laughs> a little late. A little <laughs> late. I can do better than that. That was a little late. It seemed like a perfect jump, but you landed on a banana peel. <laughs> uh, I can do better. I can do better. All right, ready? A fella just got launched by the stable. Oh, that looked good. That was perfect. Don't want to get too funny oh, before the show. Oh, I felt that one in my groin. 
<laughs> Let me wake up. Oh, come on, legs. Go. Don't do this to me. Practice waking up. Remember, you got to think Z and nothing else. For Let it hang for a second or two. You're right, Pilon. I never think the right Z. I am a muddy mess. Hey, yeah, you are. I wonder if we can take a bath in uh, the hotel there. Oh, yeah. Like uh, Arthur Morgan, the legend of the West. He's not real in this world. Quiet, Pilon. Yeah, yeah, he is. <laughs> can we say his name and it's not a trouble inducing? Oh, is that fail RP? I think so. And I do not want to be fail RP. That is the last Pilon, thing I want. Pilon, look at this crowd. Look at this crowd. I'm There's... whispering now. Let's go see what's going on quietly and maybe not insert ourselves if they're a uh, troublemaking bunch. Okay. Let's do it. I don't have snake venom. I'm sorry, Melvin. Oh, that's all right. Where to buy sub? Where to buy sub? <sighs> yeah, there's nothing there. Is there more shops around here? Yeah, I guess I just... No, I'm not going over there. Probably and best they... I don't go and interrupt at the minute. Yeah, come on. Who's that? Is that you? You know what you get for giving me snake venom right now? A thousand dollars. You like that? Yeah. What's your number? Yeah, right. I'm gonna join you. I'm paying a thousand dollars for two snake venom. Thousand dollars. Hello? Oh. Hey. Henry. Oh, wait, that's not Henry. Okay, my bad. I have a favor to ask of you. Yeah. Yeah. You gonna shoot me? Oh. Wait, is it? What is this officer doing? I got shot and roused earlier. P Lone, do you wanna go no. to the bank really quick with me? <laughs> All right. Nope. Where is it? Oh, here it is. Just in case. Oh, you're making a deposit, I see. Oh, this is a library. This does seem to be the library. Well, that's confusing. <laughs> Why is it in a bank? Bank's over here. Bank's this window. All right. All right, let me put in. Howdy, sir. Howdy, sir. Howdy. Oh, you hit your head on the ceiling. So tall feller. Uh -oh. All right, I put uh, so I have 190 in the bank. Fantastic. And I kept 20 something out just for snacks, travel this snacks. This is certainly the busiest time we've been in. This could be a big. Are you getting off? A big thing. A, a big amount of guests to watch. That's pretty exciting. What do you say we start telling people what's happening in nine minutes? All right. Well, how do I make myself not look so freaking dirty and dingy? It's my big show. Oh, yeah. Why don't you go to the bath and figure that out? Or maybe if you <laughs> okay. go put your clothes off and on in the general store, that'll help. Let me see if that works right here. Uh, Howdy, sir. Where the hell are you going? Hello. We're putting on a bit of an immersive theater play over at the Gallows in just under 10 oh. minutes here, if you want to join oh in. Oh my god. Me. Guess what? I'm a reporter <gasps> for the newspaper. He's a That's reporter! Fantastic. You met a report. Wow, you are what a lucky day you have. Can you write I'm about our play? Lucky. I will. I'll be happy to go to your play. Yippee! Fantastic. Thank you, sir. We'll be at the gallows in just under 10 here, and that goes for you, too, as well. We'll be performing I, this I, very I special oh, immersive thanks. theater experience. I don't know where the gallows are. I can do here. Just down the street. Down, down the street, just, face the stable. Go to your left. Right there. Can't miss it. Behind the hotel there. Oh, we, uh, uh -oh. performance. Well, it'll be a Sherlock Holmes and Watson type of experience, if you're a fan of that. I'm hearing a lot of noises that I'm wanting to sh uh, shoot bullets at. So if we could stop those noises, that I want to shoot bullets at something of noises. 
Is that you, Pilong? That is intimidating. <laughs> wasn't my, wasn't me. Well. <laughs> hey, a little scared, a little scared. Uh, let's go just start yelling at this group over here. Let's tell them about the show. All right. Tama in here? Where's Tama? Hey, Wonka. No, there will be no fighting. I need Tama's cute ass here. Oh, hi. Howdy, everyone. If we may have your attention for just a moment, we want to tell you about our new show that we'll be putting on in just under Sir, 10 minutes. Sir, leave Nobody gives a fuck. <gasps> oh, no, Pilong. What's your show? Okay, getting hey, hey, mixed responses oh, throughout the, the town. The I want to hear about What's this show? show. I swear. Tell some, me about your show. Some of them want to hear, Pilong. I'm going to go change. Well, you were just complaining. Oh, sorry, oh sorry. my God. Oh, mate, carry on. Rebels, it's over at the gallows. We're sure we'll be sure like nothing, Holmes and Watson. But when I do my job, fun. you bitch Stop complain. screaming. I'm trying to hear his show. <laughs> Sorry for causing him trouble here. No, no, it's not trouble, gallows. mate. Not we're trouble. Sure. We're Sherlock and Watson. Brother, you we'll get be solving a mystery. From? The crowd will be involved. It'll be very thrilling. Immersive you theater. Okay. Where have we got to go to? The gallows. Down the street to the left. Oh, at, behind I'm the hotel. Now, then. I'll meet you there. Sounds good. See a few. Go to the gallows, brother. Well, I'm full of shit. <laughs> See, this is kind of what I was feeling about Valentine. I feel like there's some uh, <laughs> violent types here. A violent type? Violent types and Valentine. Excuse me, sir. Beautiful Arabian horse. Oh, tried to give a compliment to Real Man. He didn't quite won't care. It's understandable. Wow, look at that. Four of people heading towards our big show. It's <laughs> a lot here. of people. I'm a bit. Should we do Romeo and Juliet or t Tried and True? I don't know. I kind of sold them. I'm on the Sherlock and <laughs> Oh, yeah. Thing. You mentioned that already. All right. Let's just mention that. let's do their Sherlock Holmes then. It's good to have variety. There's a dead horse over there to your left. My God. This is a lawless <laughs> town. <laughs> Uh, I'm starting to think we should just head over there and not keep them waiting. If All right, let's see. Yeah, I'm kind of scared to keep them waiting. Let's go. There's a show happening at the gallows yeah. in like one minute. Yeah, if you'd like to watch. Is it an execution? No, it's a play. Oh, oh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't seem to like that. Even worse but than she's going? But <laughs> she's going, I guess. Does she know yeah, what's happening? That's optimal? my aunt. She's very um, agitated easily, I guess you could say. Does she not like oh, theater? Right. I mean, I don't, I don't think she has anything against it. She's just worried that someone's going to die. Oh, no. Well, we promise we'll keep it PG. We'll keep it very calm and collected. Okay. Not rile the crowd up. Well, let's go do it. Let's go see. I want to see. He wants to see, too. Right. I'm worried about the lady sheriff not liking us. <laughs> Me too. I think she I, might hate me. Do we even invite these people? Or... Yeah, let's uh, Everyone! Risking? Let's do it. There's a show going on, a play at the gallows in it. one so, minute. So, Y'all so, are invited. So, so. Please stop by. A thrilling murder mystery, and one of you may be the culprit. Who's it gonna be? That girl in the orange was excited. All right, let's go. Oh my god, P. Long, look at this. Sierra, I can't do this. <laughs> God, Sierra, God. there's the biggest crowd we ever had, and I believe a full half of them want to put a bullet in our heads. That's true, but we just gotta power through Pilon. Think of the cart. Think of our new wagon. Oh, eyes on the wagon. Eyes on the wagon. Let's not keep them waiting. Let's go. Not his weekend. Hello! I don't know. Hey, James. Hello! What an amazing turnout for their first show in Valentine! This is incredible. Our best turnout yet. Why don't you give yourselves a hand for coming out supporting local theater? Yay! Uh, a funny joke. We're number one. A parrot just flew by. If that ain't a gift from God saying this is going to be our God, best show my left. Parrot. I love him. He's beautiful. Thank you for bringing Not him along to the show. We have our own gifts from God, sir. I th well, thank you to consider that. All right. Let's, about God? let's, let's keep this a lovely show. No, We're Melvin, so excited that Melvin, you're here. 
This is a Stop secular it. program. Nothing uh, overtly religious here. It's just going to be some good old-fashioned escapist theater. So this here is a show, if y'all have heard about Mr. Sherlock Holmes... This is going to be a murder mystery, but one of you will be the killer. Who will it be? We'll have to figure it out know. in the play. My hey, name's wonderful. Sierra, and this here's P-Long. Howdy, folks. Thanks again for coming out. We take Woo! you now to exterior. Tall building. Night. I am a guy who's not Sherlock Holmes, a regular guy. I'm a what a lovely and beautiful day it is. <laughs> Or did I say it was night? A lovely, beautiful night. I'm a mysterious figure. One of you. Here I come forward to do the unspeakable. I want to kill in cold blood. My motive? Unknown. Whoa. Let me go. No, don't do this. To death. I am surely dead. Cut to the Good next evening, day. folks. I'm now Sherlock Holmes, the renowned worldwide as the world's greatest detective. This here is my partner, Watson. My name's Watson. <laughs> Welcome, to our... <laughs> Welcome to our show. I'm a little crazy feller, little crazy bastard. Welcome to the show. You... Welcome to the show. You Watson, you pop down. All right. We had to solve Sorry, a very Holmes. important mystery. Yeah. A man was killed here last night. And they need the two okay. most Shh. famous detectives Shh. to solve it. Can we have anyone in the audience want to take part in our little show? Me! Me! Pick me! Pick me! Pick me! Shit! Pick me! Pick me! Pick me! Sir! I'm right here. Okay, we got one, right. two. Any Anyone else? How yeah, about four? On. Why not four? Let's do it. All right. Let's There's line them up on the gallows up here. There's five of them. Oh, Everyone up and make sure to project. I hope so. Dr. Oh, Holmes. Shit. Not if you're innocent. I'm scared of heights. <laughs> Dr. Holmes, how are you going to figure out this murder mystery? My dear Watson, it is elementary. Love. What we must do is. What is that word? Question. It's a tight name for an easy school. Oh, really I can't wait school. to solve this mystery. Watson, you be professional. Sorry, Mr. Holmes. <laughs> I'm tired Holmes. of having these talks with you while we're out on the job. Sorry, Mr. Holmes. Not sorry. Oh, you, you rat. <clears throat> Hello, subject number one. What may I ask is your name? Joseph. 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 Ah, and the Technicolor Dreamcoat, eh? Sir. Now, where were you last night at the time of 11.32 p.m.? Uh, I was actually over at Justin's house down there. We were getting fucked up in his hotel room. Woo! I'm and Justin! Justin would corroborate that? Uh, we, we, we were drinking some beers and some whiskey, and we were just getting fucked, and then we, yeah. Interesting. Okay, we'll have to cross-check that with, with Justin. And do you, may I ask, have Let's any to take the D. Screw kids? this. Goddamn Fantasia ran it to the ground. Melvin, Terrible shut ass. up. Oh, yes, you does, shut up, you does. goddamn troglodyte. He does. Goddamn <laughs> hippie. Go hang yourself. He loves to kill people. I'm, I'm hearing, uh, feeling like you do. I'm getting a little extra sensory perception <laughs> that you might be into killing. But we'll come back to you later. Thank you for your time, sir. Joseph. Pleasure I, to meet you. I, I love to kill people. Oh, oh no. we'll take that into account. <laughs> we'll take that into account. Subject number two, what may I ask is your name? Emily. 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 And mm -hmm. where were you at the time of 11.32 p.m. last night? Um, I was planting. Planting. A noble pursuit. Pretty big. Anyone who can confirm Planting that? poppy seeds. <laughs> um, I don't know. <laughs> I right. didn't see anybody. <laughs> Hmm, this a feels a little suspicious, Pilon. I mean, but, Sherlock. No, 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 but What's see, the, the thing is, is I'm I innocent. I have never, ever hurt anyone in my play. entire is life. Someone being home? Bullshit. No, it's a place. Well, Watson, do you have I any just... questions for Emily? I have a question. Explain what's going on here. Did you do it's the murder? Play, God, did you do God, the damn murder? It. 
Mm. Nope. No, you take this seriously, <laughs> Watson. But I know the guy next to me. He likes to he likes to kill people. Uh, can so you, if you can hear me, what's going on here? Our pants are literally on fire. fire. She just pointed to this guy. So we are here. doing a play. We are trying to be here. professional. Well, we got listen. permission. That ain't happening. What? <laughs> Go ahead, do it. I dare you. No bulls. What over. permit do we need for theater, hey, sir? Hey, why don't I have a rope? One of us both have the Hello, answer. everybody of Valentine. James right. King here. I just wanted to say hi. That's all. Fuck all right. Hello. That's all, folks. Our uh, play, Andre. guys. Shit. Joseph just pulled even... the knife Did out. Nobody just see it <laughs> really yeah. quickly. Oh my god. Today. All right. Be... I'm going to stand away suspicious. from the murderer. If you Thank... can hear me clear off the platform. Thank you. Why? <laughs> Why? What's do we got permission do from the police doing any... from the law lady over there? This is a part of the show. Oh, a part. Of... Oh, wink, wink. Oh, it's part of the show. Oh, I'm so wink, sorry. Wink, wink. Oh, well, I you. And I'm the mighty Sherlock Holmes, and I'm here to help solve this murder that's been taking place in Valentine. Somebody Don't worry, Lawman. Already. Don't worry, Lawman. We'll get to the bottom of this. Play what play? You hear a play? I don't want to reward heckling, but I will say somebody was killed Play? at the start. Oh. Already. <laughs> Maybe you should have been here for that part. Moving on to our Arcade third Hero. suspect. Oh, Gotta move this along oh, forcibly. See. Everyone's getting distracted. Okay, let's speed this thing up. Come on. He's definitely killed a lot yep, of people. Yep, sorry, we did not mean to get uh, interrupted like that. Fuck out. Uh, no. Subject number three. What is your name, pray tell? I'm Ryan. 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 Good, Good strong name. Ryan did the murder! <laughs> Watson, we haven't even questioned this poor fella yet. Sorry, sorry, it's I'm getting ahead of myself. Do you, sir, have any kind of grudge against the victim? Oh, young... I don't think so. I don't think I know the victim. Uh... I don't well, think I haven't no even said there. the victim's name yet. Oh, <gasps> good point, good point. <laughs> dun, dun, <laughs> dun! <laughs> I got ahead of myself. I just he got you myself. there. He got you there. He did a Sherlock Holmes thought. I like when you pump me up, Watson. I'll take that. Thank you, sir. We'll be coming back to you for sure. That didn't go well. And subject right. number four, finally. What pray tells your name? My name is Henry Clyde. Henry. Henry. Nice to meet you. I'm Sherlock. This is Watson. Pleasure. Hey. <laughs> that oh, was nice. Watson. Do it again. All right, one more time for you. Judith, they're doing a play. Get the fuck out of here. Is somebody already... Where's Judith? We're, we're hey, Judith, dog, fuck you. Dogs. Sorry, I know we are running low on time here. I will wrap this up. Sir, I do just need to ask where you were at 11.32 p.m. last night. I was watching Emily kill that poor fool. <gasps> what? <gasps> Emily. And I tried to stop her, but she said she'd kill me too, so I had to run. But it was her. <laughs> Oh, Emily. Wow, Emily. I recognize was, those black no, pants snitch. anywhere. There was nobody around. I didn't do anything. I was just planting. It was a nice piece. Guys, I'm night. definitely not the murderer, okay? Well, I believe that, sir. I do believe Emily but, is the one under I, investigation here. Kill the snitch. No, but kill I will the tell snitch? you. Snitch is worse than Ryan's the murderer. Ryan's hat wasn't stained with blood before. I will oh. say that. Let oh me double God. check that. Did this we hat, miss that? Hat, because uh, it absolutely was black before. It's naturally red. It was, uh, it's, it was, it's made out of red wool. Oh, that's a lie. All oh, right, audience. You had a pirate hat before. Did you steal that hat from the, from the victim? <gasps> I don't even know the victim. Because you had a pirate hat on before because you're dressed as a pirate. We're asking the questions here, Emily. You're being very suspicious. Nice. I'm not, no, no, I'm not asking. That's, that's, that's exactly what I think. <laughs> but Ryan, I mean, uh, Henry, you're <gasps> also quick to... <gasps> I've been struck. I have been struck. <laughs> Only a murder. And that's it. I'm asking the questions audience. here, Emily. Why who did you do, you do it? Why? Who is the killer? Get away from me. Is it subject one who bared oh, the knife? Oh. Is it subject, subject two... <laughs> Who Emily was planting, so called, but we also have a witness who says that she was killing it. Yes, yeah, sir. And I, I can also confirm that he was not anywhere near me. Well, but the, well, the, the victim it. is. Uh, He's a baby. He a goes suspect, to sleep though. at eight. The witness is another suspect. Quack, is it subject quack. three whose hat may be stained with blood? Blood. 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 Or is it subject blood. four so quick to point the finger? 
at so your dear fellow cowpoke. I just have a taste for justice. If you're quick to point the finger, you may be quick to point the gun. No, he has a taste for blood. That was my holsters four. are unarmed, miss, in case number you haven't two, noticed. Number two! We hear number two. Anyone else? Step four. Step four. Number four. Kill her. Two. Oh, uh, two. Hey! Two. Who said that? Only not number one. Number I better four. not find out who said that about me. All of them. Uh, number four. Sherlock Holmes, I am but a stupid Watson. Have you figured out who the real killer is and could explain it to me post haste? I think we both know who the killer is, Watson. Let's right. say it at the exact same time. That's right. Three, two, two one. one. Number Just two, Emily. Two. You oh. were the killer. Oh. You better Fuck. run while you're still Get her. Get her. Arrest, her. Arrest that Get woman. Her. You get back here, Emily! Get yeah, that woman! <laughs> and that is the thrilling conclusion to our fair play. Thank you. When do we hang her? Oh, wow, that was amazing! Woo -woo. <laughs> when do we hang her? Hang her. Shit fucking Fantastic. <laughs> uh, this Once again, this play was free. Thank you all for coming. We do appreciate gratuity. I want my money back. We, you I didn't give us any. Uh, amazing. I no, want my losing. time back. That's nine one six. Oh. That's justice for the man you killed. I want blood. Let's give Kill it up somebody. For our, yeah. for our uh, volunteers here, huh? Yeah, yeah let's give it up for our volunteers. volunteers. Let's go, Ginger Woo. Pants. Woo! Thank you. I want to see blood shed. Good job, everybody. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's go, Ginger. We're definitely thank not the murderer. Soulless murder. motherfucker. Thank let's go. Thank, let's you. go. thank you. Thank uh, you. Let's go. Thank you. You want to go pick pen? Let's go. I appreciate that. Thank you. Oh, right. big oh, jump. That almost hurt. Thank you, Justin everybody. Justin is spinning out. Have a lovely day, folks. You take care. I'll be expecting my check in the mail. Thank you. Ah. Go fuck yourselves. <laughs> Happy lot. Let me whisper <laughs> something. Happy lot. I yelled. Who'd you say? Who'd you tell the fuck it comes <laughs> He said, I'll wait for my check in the mail. And I thought, you know what? I've just been heckled for half an hour straight. Why don't you go fuck yourself? <laughs> that was our toughest show. There's no <laughs> doubt about that. That I think was we the worst the one yet. We had the meanest crowd. A guy came on stage and told us to break it up for absolutely no reason. <laughs> Yeah, I was. I was fully unhinged. Did we f figure out if that was real or was it just him being part of the play? I don't think it was him being part of the play. What an asshole then! <laughs> no, like, I think he was just on some kind of power trip. He's like, oh, people having fun? <laughs> Time to stop that. Yeah, go move that board back and forth. That was so rude then. If that was real, I could weak at how rude that was. That was bizarre. <laughs> wow. But right, I do have right good news. Middle. Oh, what'd you The get? aunt who said, what'd she say? Bullshit when we told she her? She goes, not that bullshit or something like that when we did yeah. it. Yeah. She tipped $500 <gasps> and four fried chickens. <laughs> four fried chickens. Well, that, I thought this was a bust. <laughs> this was a <laughs> I'll hold our biggest success yet monetarily. Can, can I actually have one of the fried chickens? I am almost dead of hunger. I forgot to mention this whole time. <laughs> I got two fried chickens. Thank you. There you are. There you are. Wow. That was so... My morale's kind of low, Pilon. <laughs> no, that did not gonna me lie. To go find a, We got to just hope there are more cultured crowd in San Denis. <laughs> <laughs> My God, they just—they were animals. <laughs> they were. <laughs> I thought my life was in danger. They were not engaging in the way we asked them to. Although our, our volunteers, they were great. They were great. Our volunteers were good. I liked them. They actually were improv and and living with ad living with us. It was the audience that was. Oh, I hear them. Listen, mm -hmm. they're talking about us. That's fucking. That's your fuck. What? That's your uncle. <laughs> I can't understand what drama's going on there. <laughs> Me neither. Man, I am like That's spent crazy. emotionally after that oh, show. Oh, I was legitimately so <laughs> nervous doing that. I just, 
part of you just wants to say, we give up, leave then. If you're, this is so awful, walk away. That one fella with the parrot who left in the middle of the show really brought down the vibe. He, that's a fella who likes all the attention on himself. I think you're right. I think also, I've been, uh, wait, I can't say this in terms that will make sense. So I just, I think I've heard him before in my eyeballs on a tube. Interesting. When I was learning about this world, if that makes sense, his voice was very, very particular. He did have a distinct voice and mannerisms about it. That was. Oh, I pretty had, horse. I like that. that horse. Oh, it disappeared. Didn't like that he didn't believe in God, but that's a, you know, neither here nor there. We're God. We're, we're a pious theater troupe. We figure God. Most people are in this time. Mm-hmm. If anything, it would wow. be confusing to not be. That's right. Draw so more what, attention. What does that put us at? We're only a few hundred away from our wagon. We are. Let me. Let's run to the bank right quick. Let's run to the bank. The storm hits. Oh God, we only got a couple minutes. Let's go. Our just I our worst show though. <laughs> I'm keeping my voice down. Yeah, oh, let's keep. Hear me. I'm keeping it down too. Oh, oh God. Lord. Did you hear that gunshot? Yes. Lock the doors. I don't like it, Valentine. <laughs> so, is the bank did specific to each town? Because I do not have any money in my account here. Do you have money in yours? What? Man, what in the fuck? I have money in my account. This is that, the dumbest shit I've ever seen. I lost my money from yesterday and oh, the, 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 the day before. Locals. What? Really? It says zero? I yeah. know you ain't killed hey, no damn triple, are you? Oh my god, what does that mean? We not. just did all that for nothing. <laughs> we did all that for the amount I have now. Okay. We can hope it's okay. fixed okay. next time. Do you want to give it to me and I'll put it in mine no, since mine seems to be working? Good idea. Do that. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's Knock it off. Soap. Knock it off. Quit punching each other. How do I stop give you it or money? you will be arrested? Yep. Oh fuck, I hate it here, Philo. No. Nope. Yeah, fuck the warning. Right. Fucking yeah, smoke him, Doc. Yeah, go do shit. I don't know why. Alright, I'll put it in really quick before this here comes to come. Please do. To shit. This is such a nightmare town. <laughs> motherfucker. Oh, oh a lo it's a local, it's a local. No He's shit. Dead motherfucker now. It's a local. That's one of those not cool persons or you know what we were saying. Hold on. Got it. Slow the Got fuck it. down. All right, I have that in there, and oh, it's safe and sound. Don't worry, I can see it. That good. All right. You, oh, wow. How the tables have turned that out. the lady oh. now looks after the money. <laughs> yeah, okay. finally. Shut a bit more up. trustworthy. Hello. Uh, tough guy. Hey, Emily. Hey, town Trey. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. They still haven't <laughs> resolved their issues from that imaginary scenario she we concocted. Couldn't, kind of she couldn't even talk to me. Right. She's so busy punching that feller in the face. <laughs> this town has devolved into absolute chaos. Let's never and come here again. <laughs> that is a solemn vow I make to you right now. I hate it here. This here is the... Oh, I see the light again, P-Long. See you in the next life there. <laughs> And that is, that is uh, <laughs> how the game ends. It uh, kind of just gives up. It kind of just gives up. <laughs> well, that was a hoot. Wasn't that great? <laughs> we did a lot. We learned a lot. Um, thank you so much for watching when the server ends it just ends at certain times you have to, you get kicked out it's kind of how it works <laughs> thank you so much for watching this was min max and i'm sure leo and i will do more of this and if you want to see leo's perspective from his side you can go to uh, leovader.com and go to his videos under playlists he's got all of our Red redemption roleplay videos the first two episodes up on there all right thanks everybody have a good day